A cool, cool thought in this film was the population bomb. How do you populate a colony? The problem is how to get a viable amount of human life off the planet. Plan B, population bomb. Over 5,000 fertilized eggs, weighing in at just under 900 kilos. We incubate the first 10. After that, with surrogacy, the growth becomes exponential. Within 30 years, we could have a colony of hundreds. The real difficulty with colonization is genetic diversity. This takes care of that. Okay, go ahead. First off, plan B does not grow the population. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> plan B is an emergency response. It is not for growing the population. That's right. That's right. By making one, one less. <laughs> Okay, so I love this idea. Super cool science fiction idea. Like, if you if you drop four people on a planet, you have four people's worth of genetics, and then Gene Bull gets messed up real quick. So mm -hmm. you bring all these embryos that are already seeded, <laughs> seeded with um with a bunch of sperm or cum, if you want to say it like that, and then <laughs> then yeah, you get you get instant babies. So so I like the plan. You you incubate the first ten, and then after that, you have ten adults that can then make the others right. But mm -hmm. that means mm -hmm. that this team of people of people that are going to the um, on the endurance that's like four people, okay. four people plus whoever is already on the planet, so five people, and okay. they're going to raise ten kids, which okay. at least in modern times is not easy. And like not you easy. have to like make sure they all survive, make sure they're all intelligent, make sure they're all good actors in the community. Like mm -hmm. like they're going to behave right and raise the other ones. Like this is still fraught with problems. That's right, because you're you're raising children in a f essentially an alien environment, uh, and you're ra four adults raising ten kids. I mean, that's not that's, easy. That's Lord of the Fly shit, <laughs> right? And 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 the adults have this like for humanity, and the kids are like, I don't give a what? This life like, sucks. Who, Maybe yeah. like there's only like twelve of us. I could just kill everyone and we could be done with this. <laughs> like, like, whoa, whoa, there, kid, like. You got, like, so, it's going to be very difficult to keep them all aligned on on a mission. But then again, it may be maybe it'll be okay because we've had these front frontier lifestyles in the past. Explorers, humans going across all of the all of the earth. Maybe humans thrive in that kind of environment. That's right. In frontier times, you'd have like ten to twelve kids. No, I guess mm -hmm. eight to twelve kids, and it'd be like a normal family. Right. But I guess the astronauts don't have any experience with that. Right, all of them have no families. Yeah, all have no families. And then would you I think you would also want to stagger the kids so they're not all the same age. So okay. Just, you know, so they get I see. So you have like like two born and then wait three years. You get three more, and then wait a few years, get two more, mm -hmm. and then that way they're like rolling out a little bit at a time. Right. And then when somebody when some of the kids are old enough, they're helping raise the younger kids and you sort of get Get the cycle going. Mm -hmm. The first few kids are like messed up, but then you learn lessons, and like the like the fifth and eighth mm -hmm. kid are like just dialed and real good people. Yep. And uh, is ten enough? I think there should know. be more. There should be more. I mean, I guess I guess just continuously every every year get a new one, and then once That's your right. population is large enough, every year you get two, and then once population is large enough, every year three and. And then, what, yeah, yeah. So I guess it would be every year you do it mm -hmm. until the population is large enough that the starts happening. And then it's natural from then on. That's right. 